New street sign just popped up in liberal New York overnight that's making Trump haters irate. The liberal anti-Trump left is a volatile bunch so it doesn't take too much to stir them up. We saw that this week when one opened fire on a group of conservative congressmen, having never dealt with his feelings over his favored candidate having lost the election. Now, droves of drivers in New York are feeling triggered by something as simple as a road sign that appeared overnight, for what it said. New York is one of the most liberal states in the nation which is why Hillary Clinton is so comfortable there that she's made it her home. Citizens there love to show support for their favorite female candidate and part of that is having a deep-seated hate for her opposition who happens to be our president. So when a sign popped up that was a sure slap in the face to Hillary, a number of anti-Trump drivers got a big case of road rage. People heading to or passing by Crooked Hill in New York State were derailed from their path when the sign suddenly changed overnight. Some people still aren't tired of thinking about Crooked Hillary, the American Mirror reports. The moniker used by Donald Trump during the campaign and Maxine Waters asserts was cooked up by Vladimir Putin himself appeared on a New York road sign after a vandal defaced an exit sign to Crooked Hill Road. The sign is reportedly located Sagticos Parkway on Long Island and had been altered sometime overnight to send the clever message, the Syracuse Post Standard reported. The creative change was not approved by the State Department of Transportation who has no part in adding the well-placed A and Y to say Crooked Hillary. The sign was practically asking for the alteration with such a perfect setup as Crooked Hill is. As soon as we were notified about the graffiti yesterday morning, it was removed, a Department of Transportation spokesperson told the New York Daily News on Thursday. Defacing public signs is illegal. President Trump likes using the moniker for his former competitor whenever he can and did so recently. Crooked Age destroyed phones W slash hammer, bleached emails, and had husband meet W slash AG days before she was cleared and they talk about obstruction, he said in a tweet on Thursday. While it's inevitable that liberals will complain and call this an immature and unnecessary attack on Hillary, it's nothing like shooting up a baseball practice to get your hate out about a particular candidate. It would be preferable that the left would take more passive approaches like this one rather instead of physically aggressive ones. We dodged a bullet by not electing Hillary for president, but if that awful option became a reality, the violent reactions we're seeing from liberals right now would not be seen from conservatives. We proved that by dealing two terms of Barack Obama. While Islamic terrorists declare jihad on anyone with a religion other than theirs, Obama's legacy is a new breed of terrorists who now are openly trying to kill people with an opposing political view. If there's anything the last few days have taught us, it's that we're at war within our own country. It's not because conservatives want to be or have brought cause for this divisive hatred, but because the left can't handle not having the control they have enjoyed for the last eight years of destruction. President Trump has been the biggest threat to all liberals hold dear that's not good for our country. Since leftist psychopaths can't easily get to the commander-in-chief, they will take out any conservative they can who either represents the Republican Party or citizens who proudly support our president. The left can deal with a sign since everyone else has to defend themselves against their incessant attacks. It's a sad state of the nation, which Hillary was part of creating, that it's actually plausible that a Hillary supporter would be so incensed by a sign like this that they're triggered by to go on a road-raging attack at the site of this. The only thing that's surprising is that nobody was hurt in the response to a silly trick on a sign.